today I'm going to be showing you how to make a first class cabin with the decoration rod on Stormworks. So you can go ahead and put this fireplace in, it's very simple. You just have to build it um, four blocks tall and then in the middle you have to do it five blocks wide to, and then you can put a tabletop clock there and then get a one by one wedge put two dark grey like the darkest grey blocks here and then just stack them up to the roof and then put a one by two wedge right here so yeah so let me delete these windows and so get the um, deck planks and basically make this well I will make it right here so the day I upload this there isn't actually going to be this ship in storm I'm just filming it now so it won't actually be up today because I'm not on like I'm not even this is not the last thing I built the thing basically I forgot to add symmetry in but don't worry you can so this is going to be a big suite so I here delete three blocks well actually nine blocks and then you're going to get your blocks and you may be wondering why do you get blocks if you just deleted them well you're going to search curve so this wall you're going to put a bunk bed on which I really like the bunk bed this is going to be a red themed room so but you can make it any color you want the other side is going to be a green themed mine and Cameron's favorite colors yes so these are going to be the main suite that make sure that doesn't happen to you and make sure you have a lot of deck chairs for passing this to the next one <laughs> So then you delete the back because you didn't need that to happen. So then when that's done, you're going to search, get the white colour and then you're going to get the windows. Because what well, just make sure it kind of blends in with the outside like this. And I would recommend kind of putting the glass facing towards the outside so then you can kind of have a little shell and then you're going to build kind of seven blocks this way and then search bed you can use any bed you want for the decoration mod I wouldn't recommend using the crew bed because this is for passengers bed botanic old ship that is what we're going to be using so then if you accidentally delete the floor and the wall you can replace the floor and the wall but this is for decoration mod people because like none of these stuff are not in the not in normal stormworks i only installed the decoration mod the day before i'm recording this video so i'm not that used to the decoration mod but i promise i will and um, do more tutorial videos with the decoration mod and once i'm complete this trip I will do tutorials without the decoration. Ignore why the steam train whistles here, that's nothing. Well, I can show you why. I can show you why now. I'll just save it and look at 2 2. That makes sense. <laughs> so the steam train whistles are basically warning bells because there isn't any bells in the decoration one actually. You may be asking why, I don't know, 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 I 
real horn, which is that. It it is. I know what I'm doing. We're going to get the robotic pivot and then kind of... So then I'd recommend getting the um, searching door, not at the end of life, because nothing will come up. And then get the basic door with a window. I kind of messed up something. Before you get that, get this and then search cur. And then get the curtains. Get this word. Well, I know you would have that word, but get any colour you want. Like, I mean, I can't. I don't want. I really, really appreciate it if I can, like, if I really see, like, people that upload, like, things with kind of this cabin on it. I would really like to see what your guys' cabins look like. Like, if you, like, ever build it in Stormer, I'd really like to see that. Because, like, I mean, I'm making this tutorial, like, to help you make cabins. And if you guys actually show me your cabins, that would be cool. So all of these are buttons. Yes, we need a point of explosion. So I'm kind of making these like phones. These are phones. And then these are buttons like for syncing and like light and stuff. So it actually kind of look cool.
so yes you can get like a swaddle even so if you want to kind of angle your mask if you make one that's why I kind of have a mask be able to angle because I really like angled masks because they look really good. So I don't even recommend putting it at 0 0.15 to make an angled mask because it won't be very angled. So yeah, we're just going to continue with the cabinet. And then we're going to make this top bunk. So the top bunk will get a window as well, like, so make it kind of fair. This one is kind of going to be... No, it can't be at the door. It can't. I think I've messed up something here. I might actually have to do one block lower. this bit so you can't actually have curtains here but that's okay because that looks out to the sea those curtains are for like those curtains I mean we might actually be able to put curtains in that so then once that is deleted, you can kind of make your a little ladder leading up to the top bunk. Because like the top bunk needs ladders because how will you get up to the top bunk if it doesn't have any ladders? Get up to the top bunk. ladder here that you can use to get up and down from the top bunk. I know this ladder actually isn't a working ladder but it's a nice little decoration you could add. So kind of a little support for the top bunk we're adding now. You know what I mean like you don't want the top bunk to break because like, I mean, then you'd fall like off the top bunk. Well, people hate falling off top bunks. I know people like, are on top bunks and then they just like, ah, such a beautiful night. And then, like, um, like probably a lot of kids fell off the top bunks if they have a bunk with the puppy. Ah, so cozy. And then, bah, they just fall off their top bunk. <laughs> yeah. So that's why we don't want the top bunk to fall because like, <laughs> like if kids are staying in this room they'll get hurt because like, you know kids like when they fall, like young kids they like usually like, like squeeze the whole place down which is terrible. Come on, he's like, still squeeze the place down when he gets hurt, very hurt. Like, <laughs> mommy, I got hurt. Yeah. It's not good. So, I'm just decorating the outside right now. So yeah, I'm just decorating the outside. <laughs> so yeah, now you have the top bunk done. We're going to actually make a little nightlight that comes out of the wall. This nightlight is going to kind of be on um, that because like you like it's gonna have to be kind of on this like I mean I just like getting this kind of dim white color because it looks really nice so then I'm going to kind of put the lights which way do I need the lights like 
Maybe but that could work. Let's hope it does work. Or the last one plays it that I mean, like. Now. Okay, here will definitely work. No, not two blocks. Just here. Yes. So then you get this, connect it, and there. I do love the marina lights. They look really good, like, especially when they're kind of on, like, at the edge, kind of like what the Botanic had. I actually should record the video on this amazing, humongous Botanic I have. So yeah, I'm going to do nightlight because if kids were sleeping here, like they would usually have nightlights. You know what I mean? Nightlight. And the reason why I'm putting in two nightlights is because usually kids like nightlights. Very young kids like that are scared of the dark. They like nightlights because like. You don't want kids to get scared of the dark, like, I mean, it's terrible, like, if you were ever scared, because I don't, because, like, we don't want kids to be scared, like, I mean, they're literally in the middle of the ocean, <laughs> why would they, scared <laughs> this looks too new. Let's hope Stormworks doesn't kick me out like it sometimes likes to. Oh yeah, bed. <laughs> so this one is kind of going to be the main bed. I like getting this one because I made it and it isn't too bright. This bed is actually kind of going to be um, So now you're going to search shelf And then there's kind of going to be a few things in here And now we're going to get a um, pan. This is going to look really cool, but you're going to kind of get handles and kind of put them kind of two blocks away from me so that actually works. And then you're going to kind of put. Shelf. I know it looks really good. So now you're going to get more shelves. Shelf. Because look, when you put the shelves here, like look how good that looks. So yeah, this is a very nice cabin. Nod, you can add like kind of decoration, like you could put like some little lines kind of going up here. Actually, I'm going to kind of make this kind of a paint block kind of thing. So I'm kind of going to kind of remove some blocks. And then you go to search paint. And then you get the paintable indicator. And then you kind of put it here, I know this doesn't come with the decoration mark, so which I'm kind of very happy about. So it kind of look like vines, that's what it kind of looks like. So then you're going to kind of paint it white then. Because you want to paint it white before it like you. Now it kind of look kind of like a little bit of a vine. Is what I'm really going for. Mm -hmm. 
And since this is your game, I am going to have probably more sweets than this. Because, like, you know, it would be nice to have more sweets. This is just going to be a tutorial on how to make it. Now, most of this stuff stuff is up to you, but this has, but I know a lot of you don't have the decoration mod, so in the next video I do, I'm do just a normal cabin. Because I know a lot of you probably want that, because like, a normal first class cabin, basically. So yeah, it's kind of this kind of, kind of like this. Oh, I hear doors. And happy Easter, guys, because... One second. Okay, Mike is back on. Because I don't know what that was even for. <laughs> oh god, camera's going quick. Yay, we can finally make our vines. So you can kind of just kind of make it a big kind of squiggle, make it connect up because, like, kind of two different, like, all different colors. What is it, Cameron? Oh. So kind of make sure the vines kind of shaded, kind of like this. And make sure you don't turn the window a different color because that's bad. And then get to kind of lime green. And make sure you actually don't do the window. Oh, those vines actually kind of look very nice. Now look at that detail, kind of a little vine, so then you're going to save it and I call, I'm going to call it vine, and when you get in, you're going to, look at that vine, and look at that vine, it looks so good, and when well, I put the curtains there, it's because then you can close the curtains. And when I was talking about heavy storms in the Atlantic, I wasn't right. Like how do you really have storms in the Atlantic? So 
kind of out here somewhere kind of nice like out here it's very nice for a deck chair two deck chairs out of here kind of kind of tree because that's the max people that can be in this suite So we're going to kind of have the end one is kind of going to be on its side. I'm kind of going to have to climb over the deck chairs, but that is okay. Because I mean like, these deck chairs are kind of meant for like relaxation. So yeah, while you're on board you can kind of relax. Oh yeah, I forgot to add something. Where is it? What was it? Oh yeah, these walls are very plain. Like I think we could add like something along them to make them kind of nice actually. Two brown. Oh, 
Oh, that would actually kind of look very nice for clues. Like, if this was a clues, I know what these lamps would look like. They'd kind of look like this. Going through. Kind of like that. So what could, what are we missing? I'm missing a nice stand for here. So first you're going to search hand and then you're going to get the light switch. Actually now you can put handles on. So you're actually going to get a shelf, just a shelf. You're going to get a shelf and then you're going to put a, a light switch, an old light switch because like, I mean they're very nice. IDHT. And then because like, I think it would be fair if there's a night light for like, kind of everyone. That's what I'm thinking. And then you're going to connect this. And then this. But there is still one more thing you need for the first class cabin. You will kind of need a couch. So, what I'm going to do for the couch is I'm kind of going to get like. Kind of like. The white light. Actually, this is that one. Actually, the white light. Because I was making an airport in Stormworks and I used this, so I think it would probably kind of look better. It's a thing, the kind of lighter colors look better. So kind of a little couch area. Kind of, it's a little couch, which looks pretty cool. That's why I put it. It is first class, so this couch is kind of going to be a photo. Hold the book. So what you're going to do is you're going to put them. Whoops. So first you're going to search whoop. And then you're going to put whichever one you want. I'm going to do the well, whoop and go and put it here because this is going to kind of be like a couch that can kind of fold out of the wall. Kind of like what the second class had on the Titan. Couches that could fold up into the wall. So kind of that's what we're building right here. Because if kids go on board, they usually go like And then we're kind of going to build a little bit. And if you ever watch the first class life tutorial, does make the same thing but wet.
I need to say the ropes can be different, it doesn't matter. The vines, the vines, the vines, the vines. I didn't put symmetry on because I don't know. And then you're going to set cur again, I got it does. Set cur if you want the curtains. <laughs> and then you're going to um, basically get the curtains. Like we did a lot of times. I know you guys actually do like tutorials because like this is just for decoration mod tutorials because some people probably have them and they're like but I want to use the mod but I want to use the mod but I want to use the mod oh yeah now I remembered what we're going to do now I remembered what I thought I forgot what I forgot so first you're going to kind of get this and make a little table and then you're going to get some books. So you're actually going to paint it white because. So I'm going to, going to stack these books and kind of add these books on the side. It kind of looks like they're randomly stacked, doesn't it? Because. So now we're kind of going to put some books on the floor, kind of like this. Because if they were kind of reading some books, they'd kind of put it on the floor, kind of like that. And then we're going to kind of put some, kind of like this. And then more books. Yeah, that actually looks pretty good. Like a lot of, a few books. And then you're going to search boat. And then this should pop up. So you're going to get the model boat and kind of put it uh, like kind of white. You're going to kind of put one beside the clock, kind of like that. And then you can put um, kind of another one. On M. Um, you can put another one on the table if you want. But I would usually put another one kind of like. So I'd kind of put one right here. I kind of put like another like little bedside table like right here. So then you're going to get the handle again. And what you're actually going to do is you're going to place a bed underneath here. So you're actually going to have to delete these. Because I know some beds kind of have like an extra little bed underneath it. Because when me and Cam have sleepovers, like I always have to sleep. I'm kind of one of them. So you can do this if you want, but I just think it's really nice decoration to do. I know the only way to kind of fix this thing. If you kind of want to do this. I make a tree blocks one, that's what I recommend.
So then you're going to, going to get a bed, so it's a bed, and then put the old flip bed, and then you're going to kind of put it underneath. Well, you can put it underneath. You're kind of going to put it like a little mattress on the floor. Kind of like one of those kind of little beds you'd pull out. And then you're kind of going to add kind of rope anchors, kind of like right here and here. And then you kind of put some rope anchors. Kind of. So now you're going to set rope. So you're going to kind of get these rope anchors. Because I know like there are some kind of beds like this in the world. So first I'm going to kind of get these. So I'm going to kind of get this kind of like So what you're going to do is you're going to delete all of this and then you're kind of going to place this kind of here and then actually you're going to equip the grey because then and then you're just kind of going to do this straight up I kind of immediately and then this is kind of going to be like the stern of the Titanic. You don't have to do this. I'm just kind of doing it as a little Easter egg. I kind of in movies like the Easter eggs that like might be out of like different movies or other things. So here's the back of the Titanic. So I usually use kind of this to kind of make the way so actually we're going to kind of make it up So in real life the stern of the Titanic is mostly destroyed so we're kind of going to do kind of black like that like a destroyed parts kind of like seeing through the thing and the other room is going to be two shipwrecks well there's basically two shipwrecks at the same time like it's the, basically the same shipwreck, but like since the Titanic was kind of separated, like a broken half, as if you know in the Titanic video. Because, So then you're kind of going to get that, and then you're kind of going to do this. Yeah, that looks good. That's the mask. 
part of me because in real life it's kind of I go down. It's kind of make a little kind of thing right here. Kind of is kind of This is kind of greenish. And then you kind of make it like that. To, it's kind of shows the engine. That's gonna be harder to see. Oh, the stone is, isn't raised. Yeah, that looks actually pretty good. So, yeah. The tutorials and make this first class cabin so let's put it in and see how it looks. I just type one and let us see what we have. There's no tsunami. 